Hey y'all, welcome back! God, I'm excited to play this game more. This is still the same recording session as last time. I just, I'm having a lot of fun playing this fucking game. I need to get better at shielding. Slime, big slime. Everyone loves a big slime. Slime time, slime time. Everyone loves the slime crime. Okay. Oh. Cool. Neat. I didn't need that. It's not what I was aiming for, but I'll take it. Just like, I'll take this. 50, I've got almost 600 fucking beans. Game, let me do something with them. Why didn't the Mage King do something about the flooding? Mentor says that the mages are protectors of Mistralia. The Mage Kings even mended the land. I don't know, Zia. Some had other priorities, I suppose. I don't see what would be more important than protecting such a vital organ of Mistralia's economy. That's enough. Focus on your task. Oh man. This is the Mad King's spellbook. That's why it's gone. That's why it wasn't there. Because it's mine. I just thought of that. And that would explain why they were the Mad Kings. Because... They were talking to themselves. By talking to their spellbook. Which talked. Calling it now, that's what's up. I came to that conclusion like four episodes later than I probably should have, but I guess it's because the the book's getting so defensive now. Like, well, maybe maybe they had bigger priorities. Which, like, if that wasn't you, you wouldn't get so defensive. fuck fuck I do
Sure would love to use those for something. Fuck, loser. All right. Shit. Shit. You know, this seems awfully precarious. There we go. Spin! Okay. I don't know what this is accomplishing. Filling this hole with water. I don't know what good that does, but I do know that I absolutely have to do it. I know more than anything that it must be done. that fucking uber kill spell I made but just burning all of my mana in one spell seems like maybe a bad idea leaving myself completely defenseless and attackless <laughs> For a hint, might not possess what I need. Then fuck off. Slime, slime. Ow, what hit me? Ow. Shouldn't you be dead? The answer is yes. Ow. That was dangerous. I forgot they drop a bomb. Oh. Neat. Ah, 
Uh oh. I need to fix the water bridge. But how? Oh. Thought I could drop down onto that bridge, maybe. Looks like a new. Okay. Oh, that's a big ass slime. That's a really big slime. Oops. Oh, boo. I guess that worked out. Oops. Give me the soul beans. I swear, some of the purple ones I need to work really hard for, and some are just like... Given. Some are just like, oh, you're playing the game? Here's a purple soul bean. And none of them, to date, have a use. Okay, so this has not helped me. Oh, that's simple. Um, uh huh, of course. Small slimes do become big slimes sometimes. I thought so, but I wasn't sure. <laughs> oh, this is gonna be a boss arena. Right? No? this the boss arena then? Yes. I hate it.
I hate how many eyeballs they have. Oh. Good to know. The beam is deadly. No. Okay, this is clever. Ow. 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 The little one kind of looks like a cheese. You ever notice that? How the little one kind of looks like a cheese? Oh, he got a full heal. I don't like that. Come on, punk. What you got? You got nothing. Got greedy. Boom! Broken the cheeses. Easy fucking pieces. Hey, where's my fucking bonus health and mana? I appreciate this. This is gonna be good, but... Zia, I am Kalos, the Sage of Aqua. Water mastery is mine. I can impart this knowledge to you so you can have a chance against the foe you must defeat to save the valley. I'm ready. Beware of, beware of the hunger for power. It is what doomed the last Mage King. I thought it was celestial magic. Celestial magic itself does not corrupt. Trying to control it does. Craving too much power while lacking the patience to learn to control it. Aetius never learned patience or mercy or good judgment. He just, he had a hot temper, boldness, and a love for hurling power. He tried to harness the power of celestial magic, but it fought back and drove him mad. And for that, the valley suffered. How? Although he never fully controlled celestial magic, Aetius was still a very powerful mage. The last mage king went on a rampage up and down the valley, convinced there were that enemy mages were lurking everywhere. In two days, the villages of Brazer, Calanth, Dowers, Dowers Bridge, Laureld, Melomar, and Tancris were left in smoking ruins, never to be rebuilt. If you hadn't stopped, there would be no mages in the valley now, or anyone at all. Who stopped him? His battle captains. They devised a plan with a mage named Sabinus that culminated in stopping him. No one knows what happened, but only one came back. He proclaimed himself the Marquis and started to rule over Mistralia. He banned all magic from the land and closed down the port and all, the, and all other borders. But why did the remaining mages agree to this? Most were annihilated by Aetius in his folly. And their duty was to safeguard the valley, not battle with it. The mages of Mistralia must always watch over the land and now it's your responsibility as well. For this, you need to learn to master water. Now go, hope of the valley 
Now go, Hope of the Valley. Find the rest of my fe fellow sages. Tarry not. Should light where sunlight does not reach, seek the Sage of Gaia below the ground in the old mine. Cool. Um, and with that, let's call this episode. So thank you for watching, y'all. I love you very much. I'll see you next time. And remember, Black Lives Matter, defund the police. Bye-bye!